Uh, hi guys, welcome to the video. My name is Chris, this is Bionics Gaming, and we're going to be continuing the uh, playthrough on Bloodborne. Uh, so in the last video we cleared... what did we clear? We started going into the, um, the Forbidden Woods. Uh, clearing about halfway through that. To find the uh, Tonsil Stone. Uh, so in this video we're going to make use of that and kind of go to an optional area earlier in the game. And uh, clearing through that. Where do I need to be? So I'm going to be teleporting to um, Grand Cathedral. Um. Okay. So. So the next part I'm going to go to in this um, is again an optional area, uh, but you can also access it. Uh, a bit later on in the game. Um, if you want to do this optional area, you could come back later and kind of do it all in one. But uh, I think it's nice to break it up sometimes. Just a bit quicker. Are we can get friends in. Motherfucker. Got no frenzy res resistance at all with this uh with this gear on. Um so yeah, so in this bit we're gonna head to uh, the right of the cathedral. <coughs> or left as you come out the cathedral gates. Look at all this bit. So don't need to worry about this this area too much. There you go. Is that guy even dead? He's not dead. Come back for it. So it must have like buffed himself, right? Oh, he's buffed. He's angry. Fuck that shit. Let's ignore him. Ah, jump him one shots. Is he still following? Is he gonna come out of that air? It's he's speeding up. I can hear him. Is he coming? I don't really want to find out, but I'm having so much trouble with these guys. I find it hard, hard to time these ones. Okay, so <clears throat> because we have the uh, the tonsil stone uh, from that house, uh, the first one we came to when we entered the Forbidden Forest, should be able to enter. Ha <laughs> ha 
Oh, Amidala. Oh, Amidala. <laughs> Have mercy on the poor bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Other spell Electra building Um Where are the to behold the divine it must be such a pleasure you're in my debt you know you're nigh on a beast of the field but here you are treading a measure with the gods <laughs> are your feet as fat as your wits Oh, cease this dithering. Take the plunge. Throw yourself to the wolves. <laughs> uh, so people, people are familiar with the uh, Soulsborne series. I recognise this character. Are your feet as fussy? <laughs> Moving on this bit, but in a little bit, in a little while. I have tell with his like bald head. So the lecture hall, first floor. It's not open from the side. Hey, look, hey, little apple. How's it going, man? How you doing, my friend? Where's it actually open from? At least this isn't the, the big one yet. Red jelly. So we're not going through that door just yet. That's going to take us into a whole new other level, which I thought I would have had time for tonight, but because I came on later, I've been chatting about it. I don't think I've got time to do this bit. So I might just cover this uh, lecture hall for, for this video. Student's uniform. key okay so that's all we need to get to enter the other side and we've got these new uh, new enemies in here Uh, all these jars filled with a bit of eyeball. Uh, 
Um, and then we've got the next room. That's where the action starts. There's uh, quite a few of these guys. some reach on them. Uh, and a little bit more health than what I thought they would have. But this ain't gonna do much. But it does. Fuck yeah. Group them all up for a molly. Job done. That's how you do it. Uh, what else do we have down here? Who are these guys? They've just, they've got like just a little bit uh, more health than two shots. some of them. Uh, Agua of a Breeze. Oh, I <laughs> said that right. <laughs> Um, so this, uh, I didn't really say much about these, like, um, uh, in this game you can pick up some items. Uh, so far we've got the Old Hunter Bone, uh, Agua of the Abritis, Abrit uh, and Beast Raw. Uh, these are items that you can equip to your shortcut menu and use them for quick silver bullets. Uh, so just on the right side it's got how many quick silver bullets it uses. This one, Old Bone Hunter, this uses four. Limited uses, but we need uh, 15 arcane to use it. Um, yeah, so they've all got their own thing. Old Hunter Bone is a kind of uh, like a, a shadow step, a, a quick step, as it's got in the description. It kind of gives you a longer uh, uh, eye frames when you're dodging. Uh, Agua, Agua of a Brutes, a remnant of the Eldritch Truth encountered at Bergenwort. Use phantasms. The invertebrates are known to be Aguas of the Great Ones to partially summon abandoned Abrites. The initial encounter marked the start of the inquiry into the cosmos from within the old labyrinth and led to the establishment of the choir. Uh, so yeah, I, like, I don't have enough uh, arcane to show any of these off this playthrough. I'm probably, I probably won't be getting any either. But I don't know, like maybe on the my main it would be nice to do like a, a an arcane run. Um and that is it for this uh this area for the first floor. I'll get in here yet. <laughs> Are your feet <laughs> It's just saying the same old thing, but we cleared all that stuff out. We got the uh, I guess that's the prize for going in there. Um But there is another area. Oh, there was something else in here. I haven't been through that door yet. And then we've got this room. Oh, 
put some of uh, these lying up here. Madman's. I am. Strange room. Okay, so that's it for the first floor lecture halls. Um, and then we can go out this way. And door to the outside. Um, so fast. I might, oh, I'm gonna see how far I can get through this. Uh, it is pretty long though to go everywhere in this. Our destination is there, down at the bottom. It's a pretty long path through there. There's, there's a... Oh, there's. Uh, I might as well try it. I get lost in this place. Just because... Uh, yeah, I mean, it's not too big. There's just like loads of little winding pathways. So we can sneak up on these guys. I even die a few times here. And we've got some new, uh, new beasties outside here as well. Right, where am I going? Not down there I want to go. Uh, I'll I remember where I'm going. to be going. Is it, I feel like it might... It's down this bit. not even down this bit. It's down this side. I'm gonna put two of these things down here. Let me get some sneak attacks. Nope. Oh, is that facing me? Is that my... And it's gone. Looks like a bigger version of that actually. It might be a chunk. Uh -oh. This guy's got lightning. Lightning attacks. Okay. Okay, this is a little bit slow. We've got all this, uh, this over the bridge underneath. We've got a river of poison. Some beast is in. Um, and some other, other pathways. Uh, but right now, we've got NPCs to take out. Well, there's going to be two of these. I mean, it, like the first guy's got the axe, you can uh, you can out uh, speed him. Here's the second one. Blood elixir. Ok, 
Okay, so they don't have that much health. So you can probably just like dodge and attack. Dodge and attack and keep us uh, throwing them for a bit. Um, and that's going to do... Quite exactly. But yeah, I mean, like this is a pretty straightforward map, but just because of the environment, all the all the details and stuff that's in this, it makes it look like it's more. There's more to it than there actually is. Jump over there. Ah, uh, fading lake. Okay, so I've already got this. This is the uh, upgraded version. Actually, it's not. It's a slightly different one. Lake is physical damage reduction 3%. Fading Lake is fire damage reduction 5%. Uh, and it says this transcription of the Great Ones in human voices ripples like a watery reflection. This room means lake, and those who memorize it enjoy reduced fire damage. Great volumes of water serve as a bulwark guarding sleep, and an aqua of the Eldritch Truth. How to pronounce that word. Overcome this endurance and seek what is yours. Cool. Or lake. Item. It is hard to see some of these guys as well. Um. I feel like there was a bell made in here. Or maybe that's like a new game plus thing. Are the, are the bell maidens new game plus? But yeah, I, feel like, I, I don't know if that's if you come back later or if it's a new game plus, but that Bell Maiden should be there. Anyway. Um, this is the whole lake thing, so all in there is uh, poison. Even the enemies like give poison as well. So I'll let back to the area. And, uh, and deal with the trolls first. Try and kill that. So now I'm around here as well. Yeah, you just gotta be careful when you're like going to attack one of these that you don't trigger the next one along. You just gotta worry about an extra giant rock being thrown at your head. So pick up that item. That oh, must have done. Alright, I'm gonna take try and take out this guy next. There's another guy over there who's throwing stuff. I don't think there's anything else. Ah, we've got some old paper. Nice.
God, it's still tricking them rocks. Um, all the way over there. Oh, like this next bit is the bit that I hate as well because we've got this guy. And the rocks. And the fire. Whoa, get away from that. Avoid the rocks. It's probably an easy way to do that. Just got this guy. That's so, why well, I don't even know why I'm like skin my life for these guys. They're only single, uh, single chunks, I mean chunks, and stones. Yeah, we're gonna go down there a bit later. Just can't remember what else is up here. Yeah, we got to the edge of this, brought this down, this is like a shortcut. Um, so if we go this way. That's another one of these big ones. Whoa, fight back. What do we get from these? Uh, twin out of bloodstone chance times three. No chunks yet. But it's still worth getting it. And there's that other one uh, near the start, which respawns when we come back as well. Is there anything around? I just remembered it's over this bridge as well. And I don't think I've got enough healing being items to do the chat. Um, so if you look at the top of the cliff, you can see a spider with a head on it. And loads of shiny things down there. So that's the other side where we came into, into this area. <laughs> Spider not noise. <laughs> Spider is not noise. Um, what that? Go. That we can't get back up from. Item. Clockwise metamorphosis. And a uh, Ah, so let's see what this one is. Uh, so, uh, 
Boost max HP plus 10%. So this is a nice one to have. Uh, the Twisted Cross means me metamorphosis. Rotate clockwise. This rune boosts HP. The discovery of blood made their dream of evolution a reality. Metamorphosis and the excesses of deviation that followed were only the beginning. He boosts. I'm going to put that on. At some point. Up here. Oh, there's another one of these. Little beasties. Some more single bloodstone gems. Um. Okay, let's drop down to the one. I think it just drops down to the same area, right? There's a different entryway. Down. There, so we would have come this way. Went down after the giant. This opens up with some items and some beasties to kill. Let's kill that item. Stunning deep sea. Wasted all that energy, just hit nothing. Does that lead to anything? Just to the bottom of there. Um, so do we have anything down this path? Oh shit. We got a rock guy throwing stuff. Got me good. Where's he actually throwing? Throwing throw. There he is. Can get that item down there. I missed this at the start. I was gonna go down and grab it. Um, but yeah, further down this way, there's just a uh, shortcut which I hopefully will unlock later on. And we've got that, um, that beast down here. These NPCs come back. Probably not. Maybe there's a, a little beastie over here. More shorts. And this one down here. Does he come out? This little cave.
came out last time. Like these things as well, they're, they're not even doing anything, they're like really slow, just kind of like wailing about and they're still like taking me out. So easy. Still doing good though? Uh, yeah. Not bad. things that um so yeah so if you come up this way there's usually there is a bell made another that's really annoying me though now like where's it from is it just a new game plus thing so um all right let's go try and get those echoes back I'm going to take out that beast first, so I don't, I don't get any head pains. Another one, uh, clear deep sea, which is okay. Got both now. Uh, add slow poison resistance plus two hundred. Uh, the transcription, transcription, <laughs> the transcription of the great ones in human voices de depicts downreaching currents. This word means deep sea, and grants. Augmented slow poison resistance. Great volumes of water serve as a bulwark, guarding sleep and aqua of the eldritch truth. Overcome this in this hindrance and seek quite yours. Like I guess that bit's the same for most of them. Too fast. I the other one now. Hold on. You have never played Bloodborne. Um not uh, not always, but there's a high high chance. It's um 
it's based on your insight. Um, well, the more insight you have, the more chance of items dropping. So I think it's uh, like up to 10. I think plus 10 insight is the max. Insight is the little eyes in the top right corner. Uh, but the more of those you have, the more chance you have an item drop in. Um, but most of them, yeah, they drop items. Uh, sometimes it just takes a little bit, uh, a little bit of time for them to spawn. To that bit. I don't think we get up that way. Alright, let's go grab those, uh, those echoes first. And there's another one of these guys. Um, okay, so these rock giants like respawn as well. I just rolled into one. Brilliant stuff. That was clear, man. That was clear. Um, okay, let's see if I can get to the... Uh, to unlock the next shortcut. <clears throat> uh, farming. Am I farming? Uh, you can farm in this, yes. Uh, I'm not farming, I'm just a... Uh, just kind of uh, going through everything in the game. And just uh, collecting all the items. Wow, those things are still hitting me. Got some range. So if we can get this guy to. I'm not behind him. Damn it. These guys hurt. Whoa, they got some moves as well. Jumping attacks. Cobbled flower bird. Uh, these items here, they're 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 useful in uh, to summon chalice dungeons. Um, and for those of you that don't know, chalice dungeons are like a, an extra feature in the game. They're like kind of random uh, dungeons that you can go in at, at any point from where you get the first chalice chalice dungeon in the game. Um, and they've got loads of different levels to do, and they, they've also got like upgrades for your weapons. So if you wanted to like make your character strong, you can go into these chalice dungeons uh, with the items that you acquire in the game. And I go to the to the deepest, darkest depths, get some new, uh, new uh, runes or new gems for your weapons, uh, which will be a lot more powerful than what you collect in the game. Uh, what... Do your stream start US time. Uh, so it'll be five, five o'clock uh, US time is when I would start streaming uh, for, for normal weekdays. That's uh, that's from 10 UK time, so five US time. Oh God. And you can hear that sound. I do not like that sound. That means there's a frenzy coming. I 
these enemies. I hate these enemies. Absolutely hate them. I need to be safe. I want to get out of this. I've only got four healing items left as well. And it's those things. Do you know what? I'm going to make this a bit safer. Uh, one of the things you should always try and do in the game, because uh, like all your all the gear pieces, all the items, they don't contribute to any uh, attack damage. These are all defensive. Um, so just kind of whatever you go into, you can kind of see what en enemies you're dealing with. Uh, this one causes frenzy. So I'm going to want a load of frenzy resistance, the highest that I can get. And just stack that. 14 at the minute. It's like it's just hunter gear. Wait, 56. Yeah, just hunting the stuff. 27s. There are, I think there's like a, a better set further on in the game. Um, best way to deal with alignments like Frenzy and Poison is just to equip the uh, the runes. In fact, can we do those? Yeah. It's better. I might die here. See me. She see me. Um, so yeah. So as soon as she looks at you, she puts frenzy on you, and you can see that bar in the middle. It's kind of building up. Oh god. Um, so yeah. So like, as soon as this enemy looks at you, it starts building up frenzy. That that frenzy bar is filling up pretty fast. So when that ticks, when that's full, it's going to cause a big chunk of damage to the health. Um. So yeah, let's see if we can get up there. Take it out. Oh, we're gonna have to heal. Otherwise we die. That's a lot of health taken off. Damn. I still hate those things. Oh! Cannot die by this guy, man. So you go. Taking its items with him. Um, okay. Well, so we've got, there's a there's a whole another like little section to this area, but I think because I'm low, I haven't got no more heals left. Um to try and get to the uh get to the shortcut. But what's down here? Okay, that's just a hole. We don't go down there. Oh god, I hate this. I hate not being able to complete all these. There's quite a few of these uh beasties. Some of these are uh, single. It's <laughs> enough one. I don't want to die. Am I getting closer to it? I feel like I am. I don't know what else to drop. Okay, so I'm going to try and make it back without dying. That's where I came from. See, so I think it's down that hole. I don't think we've got to worry about it just yet. Um, only one thing to get past uh, before I get to safety, I think, is there uh, just one of those guys up top. Over there is where the boss is. Anything down here? Alright, let's just get to safety. 
before we die. So it's just a case of getting past this thing. following me. Jump attack. Right. <clears throat> okay, activated. Like we've got here as well, there's still like quite a lot to do in this area. Um so yeah, I'm kinda I'm gonna leave it there. Cause it's twelve o'clock in uh on my time. I'm gonna kind of I'm, I'm gonna head back. See if we can get any upgrades for right now. And then I'll uh, continue this on Thursday. Let's take in that. Start working on that vitality. Keep going for that strength. I have blood vials. 23. Putting up the stocks. 55 in storage. Um, okay, so that's it for uh, for this part of Bloodborne. Bloodborne. <laughs> that's it for this part of Bloodborne. Uh, and anyway, guys, that's it for me. Hope you all have a brilliant, a brilliant week. Hopefully, I'll see you again soon. Uh, take care, guys. That's it. I'm out. Good night.